This is McCook's Mr. Bill. It is an honor to have you here. Brag for just a second and let you know that I've caught 122 fish so far this year. My biggest fish I caught this today was eight and a half pound carp. You talk about a fighting machine, that is. And a wonderful experience and enjoyment. And of course, catch and release. But you're here for a story. Ran the candy truck today at the park. Had a normal amount of people coming through. Most of 50 people came through. Bought my 25 cent snow cones. But as I noticed, a number of people were just walking around the park for exercise to get out of the house. A woman was walking by and she'd walked by once already with her mother. I would estimate the woman was probably 40. The woman was uh, deep into her 60s, if not into her 70s. And as they were walking along, and for a while today, it was over 70 degrees, which is an unusual temperature since we've had a week of cold snap. So it takes your body a little bit to re uh, itself to a higher temperature. The woman walking, and both women had face masks on. Two of the very few that I had them on today whatsoever. But the older woman had the face mask on and she'd already went four blocks around the, the park once and they were going for a second time. And I could tell she looked like she was in distress even though all I could see is her eyes. And she never looked directly at me inside my candy truck as the, the sidewalk goes by me. And so I stopped the ladies and I said, excuse me, I don't mean to bother you, but your mother, I assume that's your mother, she looks like she's in distress. And I handed her out a bottle of water and I said, it's free, just take it. I think she needs it. She needs it. And she looked over and realized that her mother was in trouble. And she was not getting enough air through that mask to walk around there. You bet. And she could have fallen very easily. And again, older people fall and break a bone. It can take years to heal or it can take their life. And it would have been done because somebody thought masks were a great idea for everybody in every situation. Never forget though, the experts say that you have an 18 times, 18 times lesser chance of getting a virus, be it this or a flu or anything, outside compared to being indoors with people that might have that. Keep that in mind and keep our older people safe. And masks may not be the answer. Only you can decide. But when you look at what we've gone through with this Chinese Walmart disease, and I call it Chinese because it came from there, and I call it Walmart disease because they got a pass, just like on Obamacare, when the rest of us had to pay uh, our insurance went from $400 a month to $1,200 a month for a lot less insurance. Walmart didn't have to do the Obamacare. They got a pass. Nobody else, not the little guys didn't, but they got a pass. So their employees only, their insurance went up $1 a month. Yeah, the rich always get a better deal. And if it isn't fair for everybody, it's a crime. Just as this is a crime because when a whole bunch of stores were closed down, Walmart got a pass again, didn't they? Yeah, it helps when you have billions of dollars and when your buddies are the Chinese. That's why I call this, that's right, I call it the Chinese Walmart virus.